Hey beautiful people, it's Rakeen. I'm back with another video. So on this video, I want to talk to you guys about a comment that I got where somebody, they said that they got that kickoff account and their credit score went up 99 points. So in two months, so they got the kickoff account two months ago and their credit score shot up 99 points. I keep telling you guys about the kickoff account. And when you guys are building your credits, you need to get accounts to report to the credit bureaus because that's what's going to really increase your credit score. Now, I'm also working with somebody else and we was able to um, remove 53 accounts from their credit reports. And I text them. I was like, hey, did you get those credit cards? Because I told them they need to get credit cards. We started in, in March. I told them then get credit cards. And she said, oh, no, I didn't apply because she was scared. And I'm like, what do you mean you were scared? Like, you have to get credit cards. You get them credit cards. Your credit score is going to be in the 700s. Her credit scores did go up. Um, all of them are now in the 600s, uh, mid-600s. But still, you could have been so much um, your credit score could have been so much higher if you would have just got those credit cards when I told you to get the credit cards. So that's why I want to show you all this now. So if you guys are in the building stage, you guys can see a great increase to your credit score. And, and the goal is just to start wherever you are and get it done. And then I showed you guys this comment previously for somebody else. Just as more motivation for you guys of you guys actually just getting started. So it's a video about hitting the seven hundreds. They said they eight points away from hitting the seven hundreds, and they started in January. I remember when I was in the process of building my credit, I thought I messed it up. I was like, oh my gosh, this is never going to work. And I, you know, I'm just talking negative. And then I was like, you know what? It's never going to start building if I just don't start. So I'm giving you all that message now to tell you guys, just start building your credit. Start building your credit. And I'm going to show you some credit cards that you guys can get. And if you guys are in the stage of building your credit, um, please understand you need to have at least four credit cards reporting. And I say two installment accounts. And I'm going to go over those with you now. If you guys ever have any questions, please go to my website, rakita.com, and schedule a call with me. I'll be happy to help you all, but you have to make sure that you know what's on your credit reports or let me be able to look at them. Because sometimes people call me, ask me a question, and actually their credit reports don't even reflect what they're talking about. I'm like, oh, no, that's not what's happening, you know. But definitely go ahead and schedule that call. So I told you all need to have at least four credit cards, right? By the end of this week or before next week, let me say that, by the end of next week for sure, you're going to see another list here that say you can pre-qualify for credit cards. So pre-qualify for credit cards with no hard inquiry. And you guys can already see those credit cards here. That's on my website, allthingsrakita.com. So all you got to do is go allthingsrakita.com, click on credit accounts, and then you scroll all the way down to the bottom. You'll see the credit cards that can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. So I want you guys to come here if you want to look at these other credit cards and you know you don't need any of those or you pass having just the credit cards for bad credit, you want to have a list of credit cards that can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry, definitely come here and look because there's a lot of them on here. I love the Sam's Club credit card, Capital One, Navy, Discover. I love all of those. Um, also, you have the Wayfair is a nice one. Apple for sure is a nice one. American Express is a nice one. FNBO, NASA, um, Pedal 2, Walgreens. All of these are very nice cards and they all can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. So definitely check them out. I even have a few personal loans in here for those people that want to do a personal loan. But remember, you cannot build your credit if you do not have these companies reporting to the credit bureau saying that you're paying on time. OK, and then also not only just paying on time, but you're keeping your balance low. That's another thing that's very, very important. So you can definitely come here and check this list out. Like I said, too, when you go to my website, Rakita.com, if you scroll down, you'll be able to see that list pretty soon here. And then also put in the comments, like, what other list do you want? I know I need to do a list for balance transfers. Um, that's another big one, a list for secure credit cards only. That's a big one. But let me know, like, what other list would you guys like to see? I know Equifax, TransUnion, Experian, Hardpool only is another one. I know I got a list here for TransUnion. I started this one out, like TransUnion, Hardpool only. So you can see credit cards that's going to pull TransUnion and also some bank loans that's going to pull only TransUnion. But I know I need to put that list here on my website. So definitely put in the comments and let me know like what other list I can put here to make it easier for you guys. And I'll put that list here for you. 
So I'll go ahead and work on that. It shouldn't be too hard. It's just the point that I need to go ahead and start doing it. Now, like I said, you need to have four credit cards. So let's get into these credit cards. Um, you can definitely, like I said, go through this list here on allthingsrakita.com. But when you guys are in the building stage and you're looking to really have a great increase to your credit score, check out this list right here, the best credit cards for bad credit. This is a very good list for you because they have so many accounts here that can approve you, even what you have in like a very horrible credit score because they're not going to check your credit at all. They want to check it for like um, verification let me not say at all, but they're not going to check it for, you know, see your credit score, see your accounts. They're going to check it just to verify your identity, which is a soft pull. So let's go ahead and check out some of these accounts. Now, this is that account. So she said, well, I'm going to get the self again. That comment um, yesterday, she said she's going to get that self again. And I'm like, you can get the self, but you need to have four credit cards. Okay. That self can really help you. My credit score went up over hundred some points with having a self when I was in the building process. So I always tell people to get that self, but self is just one account. You guys don't think you're just going to get that one self and you're going to be good. You really need to have at least four credit cards and two installment accounts. So this is just one of them. Another one, remember I told you they don't care about your credit, that self don't care about your credit, and also this credit builder card don't care about your credit. It is a secure credit card. It requires a $200 deposit, but they don't care about your credit, which is really good. So you can get two of these, and they're going to report to the credit bills most likely even before you can get your credit card. So definitely check them out. That's good if you have such a bad credit score and nobody give you credit. That's a great one for you. Kickoff is also another great one for you. This is the one where that person said they got 99 points. This is what they had. They had the kickoff account. And you can see right here, I show you somebody else had 74 points, but they definitely beat them with the 99 points. But definitely um, check out the kickoff account. If your credit score is over a 620, do not mess with them because we don't know if your credit score is going to go up or if it's going to go down. I just think that you're taking a chance when you have a score like that. Kickoff is great for those people that have a very low credit score and they can only really go up. They could go down technically, but like seriously, you should only be going up from there, okay? That's what kickoff is really good for. Now, the next one is a Discover is Secure credit card. This is another great one, so definitely check this one out. This one, Navy Federal and Capital One, they're all secure credit cards, but they all can graduate, so definitely check it out. And this one, somebody said that they was able to go from $200 to $2,100, and that's them graduating. So graduating means they give your money back plus increase your um, credit limit. So this is a great one. And they can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. So this is the Discover one I was talking about. Also the Navy Federal and also the Capital One Platinum Secure. Okay. So those are great ones. Open Sky, I tell people to get the Open Sky if they file for bankruptcy and their credit score is just that low that they can't get any other credit cards because they don't check your credit. So I tell people to get that Open Sky card. So definitely check that out because they're not going to give you a hard inquiry. If you're a student, get that student Chrome. Also, Credit One Bank. These credit cards that I'm going to show you now, they can pre-qualify you without a hard inquiry. They're decent, but keep this in mind. If they have a high annual fee, you want to stay away from them, okay? Please stay away from them. So you got Capital One. You got Mission Lane. You also got the Prosper credit card, Milestone, Indigo, and Destiny, and also... Yeah, those are all the ones. So try to see if you can get one of those. You can pre-qualify for it without a hard inquiry. But just please make sure you don't have a very high annual fee because that's like the deal breaker for me, a very high annual fee. And again, if you have any questions, please come at the top and schedule a call right here on my website. And I'll be happy to help you all. Keep in mind those comments that I showed you and these different things, they, they got this from building their credit. You know, they had to start building their credit by getting accounts added. So that's like the most important thing for you guys. And also make sure you keep the balance low. Please keep the balance low on these credit cards. Do not spend more than 5% or do not let them report more than 5% to the credit bureaus. But I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day or a great night. Bye-bye.